Bills passed include the Appropriation Amendment Bill, the Namibian Industrial Development Agency Bill, the Custom and Access Bill, and the Namibian Special Risk Insurance Association Bill. One of the reports tabled was the proposal for a development of a national mixed farming project in Namibia. The project is meant to encourage diversification of local agricultural produce to ensure that farmers get the best quality out of their farms. Tabling the report, Karas Regional Councillor Paulus Ephraim said the program would take up about five hectares of land per household to be divided into smaller units for the purpose of farming with various livestock, while the rest can be used to grow feed for the animals that are being kept. This will prevent people from depending only on animal husbandry, which cannot assure the sustainability during the time of drought. This is a different application from other existing projects because there is no need to go through an agent as there will be a center where this household product will be marketed and sold from. The national mixed farming method is meant to be labor intensive and offers employment opportunities for people living in communal areas. It is viewed as a long-term solution to improving food security and productivity of allocated land as farmers can only keep few livestock along with crops that are on high demand. Ephraim said development in rural areas can help curb high migration of young people to urban areas while further improving the income of farmers in such areas. Salmi Hangula, NBC News, Parliament.